Since 2014, NVIDIA's ticker symbol NVDA stock has skyrocketed by an impressive 29,000%, making it a prime example of a millionaire maker stock. Early investors who were fortunate enough to buy in could have transformed small investments into substantial wealth. However, it's important to note that past performance does not always guarantee future success. Let's take a closer look at this iconic chip maker to determine whether it remains a good investment opportunity today. Before we begin, this video is not an investment advice and must do your own diligence. However, with my experience investing for years, the content from this video has a solid research foundation. Check our patron on the description below for an inside members only access on what are the best buys now. We will also update you on what to sell for gains or to avoid losses. Subscribe to our channel so you will never miss out. A history of boom and bust cycles. NVIDIA's recent breakthrough has been fueled by generative artificial intelligence, AI. However, this opportunity barely existed before late 2022 when OpenAI's ChatGPT made its debut. Before that, NVIDIA went through a series of boom and bust cycles as its advanced graphics processing units, GPUs, were utilized in various high-demand but short-lived industries. In the early to mid-2000s, NVIDIA was primarily focused on video gaming. Later, the emergence of Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies sparked an unprecedented demand for its GPUs, these were used for cryptocurrency mining, which involves solving complex mathematical computations to verify transactions and create new digital coins. Over time, both of these opportunities, grouped into NVIDIA's gaming segment, stagnated and declined. In the company's fiscal second quarter, gaming-related sales amounted to only $2.9 billion, representing less than 10% of total revenue. Today, NVIDIA's data center segment accounts for approximately 88% of its sales. While the company doesn't provide detailed breakdowns for specific products, a significant portion of its revenue likely comes from advanced AI chips like the H100 and H200. These chips are essential for running and training large language models, LLMs. However, if demand for LLMs decreases, much of NVIDIA's recent growth could quickly disappear. The bear case. In a worst-case scenario, NVIDIA's recent surge in AI-driven growth could face a major slowdown or even a complete crash. While the company's growth numbers appear extraordinary, with second-quarter revenue soaring 122% year-over-year to $30 billion, this impressive performance might be fueled by an unsustainable AI race. Capital-rich tech companies are pouring money into NVIDIA chips, seemingly to avoid the perception of falling behind even if they aren't certain of seeing a return on their investments. One of the most notable examples is Meta Platforms, which is among NVIDIA's largest customers. In 2024, Meta projects its capital expenditures will range from $38 billion to $40 billion, with a significant portion allocated to purchasing NVIDIA GPUs. CEO Mark Zuckerberg appears confident in the potential of this investment. However, it remains unclear how Meta plans to transform this optimism into profitable results. Unlike Amazon or Alphabet, Meta lacks a cloud platform that could rent out its computing power to startups. On top of that, Meta's flagship language model, Llama, is open source and free to use, which makes monetizing it a significant challenge. This situation is reminiscent of Zuckerberg's previous major initiative, the Metaverse. That virtual reality project caused Meta to burn through approximately $46.5 billion, with little tangible success to show for the investment. Meta isn't alone in facing uncertain outcomes in the AI space. For example, Tesla, the electric vehicle manufacturer, is also purchasing large quantities of NVIDIA chips to build its Dojo supercomputer. However, Tesla CEO Elon Musk himself has admitted that the project is a long shot. A number of NVIDIA's biggest clients appear to be pursuing speculative AI strategies. If these strategies fail to deliver meaningful results, it is likely that their shareholders will push back on the heavy capital spending. This could result in a sharp decline in demand for NVIDIA's chips, the bull case. While there are valid reasons to be cautious about the stock after its significant rally, the future outlook isn't entirely negative. 
analysts continue to forecast impressive growth for the AI industry. PwC predicts that AI will contribute an additional $15.7 trillion to the global economy, boosting labor productivity and consumer demand. If this projection holds true, NVIDIA's journey to making millionaires is only just beginning. In the best case scenario, the biggest hurdle for AI's profitability is technological limitations. This is a challenge that NVIDIA itself can overcome by developing more advanced hardware, like its new Blackwell-based AI chips. As these chips become faster and more energy efficient, the cost of running large language models will decrease, lowering the threshold required to reach profitability. NVIDIA, with a market value of $3.5 trillion, is currently the largest company in the world. However, it seems unlikely to deliver significant growth from here on out. While predicting the future is always uncertain, the more cautious outlook appears more likely, as it relies on fewer assumptions. At the moment, many of NVIDIA's clients aren't seeing enough tangible returns to justify their current spending on artificial intelligence. Although Blackwell chips may trigger a short-term boost, long-term investors might want to wait for a price pullback before thinking about entering the stock. Give us a like if you like our video, subscribe and ring the bell to never miss out. Check our patron for an inside look on what are the best buy and sell stocks every week.